How in the fuck could you fix your mouth to ask a nigga? You sexy, you like dick? Bitch, what the fuck? What? I'ma keep on flexing, you don't like me, then I'm sorry, sorry. Let me say something. Before we start this video, skip ahead and skip to the story if you don't want to watch none of this extra shit. But hey, if you want to be lame as fuck, that's fine. That's that's cool with us. Good family, we just left Walmart. I know this ain't the usual intro, but hold up. Some chocolate milk, motherfucking pot sticker, and some damn cocoa puff. Play that shit. Like, I really love that fucking song. But I don't remember how much I fucking loved it. To PewDiePie said something, you feel me? Hey, you. Is people sleep right now so I can't be loud? I got something to show y'all, though, for the ones who stand with me. Social Blade stats, nigga. On the 7th, we was averaging 57 subs and 5,000 views a day. But goddammit, you come down here, look what you see. And all the cool motherfuckers. We averaging damn near 100 subs a day. And what the fuck is this? 10,000, 4, 6,000 views? I fucking love y'all. Hey, I just want to show y'all that and say thank you real quick. Now let's fucking go. Let me run y'all a little background fucking chick real quick. Yeah. We fucking doing great. But you know why we doing great? Cause one, I'm working my ass off. I'm dropping hits every fucking day. What YouTube will post two, three, fucking four times a day? Huh? Huh? And if you name one doing it, I guarantee you two out of the three videos they drop in one day is ass. I post like two and three times a fucking day and they all fucking hit. My videos should be illegal, cause these bitches dangerous, ha. Ah, they bite you in your ass and make you laugh, ha. Ah. Motherfuckers say some shit like, well bro, it's quality over quantity. No it ain't, cause over here at Mr. Fucking Me channel, nigga, it's quality and fucking quantity. Man, I'm dropping good ass shit for y'all every day by the fucking truckload, nigga. And every last one up, I'm gonna make you laugh, bitch, ha 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 ha. Oh. But hey, every YouTuber can't work hard. Some of them just got a lot of money and lazy as fuck. I'm gonna get a lot of money and show my fucking ass. Literally, my booty. <laughs> Bitch. You know, that's just some shit I never understood. How in the fuck can you have millions of fans, but you don't post shit? You post once every when the fuck ever. Then you say some shit like, I was busy, I was stressed. It's hard. And posting every day take a lot of work. Boo fucking who? Why? I get paid thousands of dollars just to make videos, and I really still have to put in work to make them? Huh? I'm rich. And I have to work for a living. <laughs> what kind of shit is that? I'm gonna tell y'all something right now. This is a promise from me to fucking you. Li you listening? Look. Look, damn it, look, yeah, you, you look, okay, you look good, alright, okay, look, listen, I do not give a fuck how big I get, how many shows I do, how many places I go, how many fucking meetings I'm in, how many business conferences I have to go to, whatever the fuck you wanna call it, I guarantee y'all I'm gonna always drop shit for y'all ASAP, I'ma post some for you pretty motherfuckers every goddamn day, <sighs> do you feel what I'm saying, at least once a day, fuck, it ain't hard, why you gotta hit so hard? Why you hit so hard? <laughs> but yeah, man, that's all I gotta say. Now let's get right into the motherfucking video. Today I'm gonna be telling y'all about the fucking time gay ass man he tried to talk to me. Oh! <laughs> Woo! Shit, this one here. Oh! <sighs> Oh, fuck. So now y'all fucking know by now. I've been doing videos for a long ass fucking time. Oh. I've been pushing these bitches out oh. for a long time. And the grind been happening for a minute. But since 2018 started when I found my recent fucking explosion of popularity within millions and millions and millions and millions of fucking views on Facebook in this year. Thank the Lord. Oh. Things have now picked up and they rolling real fast. But it wasn't always like that. I've been had fans. I've been getting recognized in pubs. I've been had supporters. I've been had bitches in my inbox. I've been had pussy and ass shots all in my fucking messages. And the niggas. Back when the fucking shit was just getting good. Cause I had just not too long hit my first million views some years ago. What the f Oh, yeah. So, you know me, I'm rolling through my inbox like, oh, like, oop it, oop it, oop it, yeah. I was single at the time. I was flirting with every old bitch that was coming through my shit. Bitch, if you was 30 cent in titties, I'm gonna suck them, little. Oh. So, I'm like, yeah, 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 true. So, my city was pop your fucking lighted with plenty. Bitch, when I say plenty, I mean fucking plenty of gay motherfuckers. Now, don't get me wrong, I ain't got shit against gay people. None at all. I don't give a fuck what you do. I don't give a fuck what you fuck. Please stick your dick and fingers in whatever you want. Do it for me, damn it. I want you to sling that fucking shit in whatever you please. If you see a frog and you want to drop the dick in the frog, I don't give a fuck. That's a fucking fact. I don't care what you do or who you fuck. Just please don't try to fuck me because that's going to start some shit 
Woo. So this is what happened. Blair just got through posting a video. I remember this shit because it fucked my head up so damn wild. I had roasted this girl on Facebook. She was from Mobile, Alabama. Shout out Mobile. Yeah. <laughs> And shout out Texas too, if you stay in Texas, a shout out to you nigga. Oh. So she had shit in her drawers, and I roasted the fuck out of it. Oh shitty booty ass, fuck. Bitch, I know your booty hole look like a dough knob lock. Oh. Roach wing booty ass. Oh. Turtle head booty ass. Oh. My drawers made out of fish and wire and sticker booty ass. So you already know I was on a fucking shit, <laughs> literally nigga. So this was like my third viral video ever. This bitch did millions of nigga. Fucking mills. So when shit got to popping the fuck out, people in my city found out. They was like, oh, you doing videos? Oh my god, boy, you funny fucking on videos. <laughs> Bullshit, cause don't none of them support me now, but bullshit. So what happened was, one day I got this message, I was laying on the couch. I ain't gonna say his fucking name, cause it did that ain't what it's fuck. But nigga, don't do that shit to nobody else. Never. Never. <laughs> <laughs> this motherfucker sent me a fire ass message. That bitch was benunciated, writing all kinds of shit. He say, hey, quick question. Yeah, that's the way to start this shit off. Would you let a man suck your dick without telling nobody? <laughs> 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 Oh! What the fuck? Fuck away from me. I was on the phone with some girl that I was fucking at the time. When I tell you, bitch, I froze. I just was like, you know, hey, I'm gonna call you back. Hold on. I read that shit like 10 times. Would I let a man suck my dick without telling nobody? <laughs> shit, what a fucking world. <laughs> God damn. Now these the fucking gay people right here that make the other ones that know this shit look bad. I read that shit in the back of my fucking head. I said, nigga, I will shoot the fucking shit out your ass. Like, man, the shit got so fucking ugly in my head when I fucking read it. I couldn't see shit but death. This nigga gotta die. It gotta be a better way to respond. No, fuck that. He gotta go. No, it's a better way to respond to this shit. Okay, what the fuck is it then? Exactly, get that motherfucker. So after about two hours of contemplating, I sat down and I thought, what the fuck can I say without going to jail? So I text him back and say, oh, nigga, hell no, I'm not with that shit. No, no, fam. Just like that, with hella goddamn punctuations and marks and shit, my whole fucking point was insinuated like a bitch. Fuck no, if you pull, if your dick come close to me, you gonna lose that bitch. I'm telling you, don't fuck, hell no, no, no. And then another one did it. This shit was barely a fucking month later. Another gay dude DM me and said, Boy, you sexy as fuck. You like dick? Fuck! I'm so fucking sick of that shit. See, I had to flash the fuck. I clicked on his ass. Skinny ass, fucking dry meat, moist smelling bitch. Bring your ass close to me. Come on, just come on, nigga. Try it. Get close. Your ass ain't gonna be able to fuck shit but an imagination. This shit was so fucking crazy. I couldn't even understand how in the fuck could you fix your mouth to ass a nigga? You sexy. You like dick? Bitch, what the fuck? What? Man, that shit played over and over in the back of my fucking head for like two days. I couldn't even understand how in the fuck could you niggas don't even come at women like this on some fucking creep shit. But you talking about my asshole. What in the fuck? What? You sexy. Do you like dick? You sexy. You like dick? You sexy. You like dick? You sexy. You like dick? He was mad than a motherfucker too. Cause man, look, I told that fucking boy, nigga, I'm gonna slap the fuck out your ass. Come, I'm bitch. I got you. Oh, I bitch. I got you, nigga. Like damn, bitch, you could at least fucking say, hey, you handsome. You still got cussed the fuck out, but still. Goddamn, straight to the dick, huh? You motherfucker. Ooh. Like this shit, I almost baby throw the fuck up. I don't want to fuck a man. What the fuck I'ma do? Count your back hair and be like, oh, you got ten more than me, nigga. Oh, your elbow feel just like mine. Oh, we got the same titties, they strong. Get the fuck out of my goddamn face for a slaughter, you bitch ass. I don't fucking get it. That shit was crazy. Then it was another nigga. This motherfucker here invites me talking about this fucking 46 year old motherfucker DM me talking about, hey man, you wanna model some underwear for me? What the fuck? See, he came in the shit professional, so I was just like, what's up? Cause the first thing he said was, hey man, I work with, well, I work with modeling agencies. I can get you a gig out here if you want to model for me. I'm like, I mean, I know they model clothes and shit. I can hook you up with some connections. So I'm like, oh yeah, I can probably, I can probably twist and turn looking good and some shit. Okay, with a big jawline, huh? All right. And that was the next message he sent. Okay, well it's modeling underwear, so I need you to send me pictures in your drawers, my fucking drawers. This nigga needed pictures of me in my drawers. See, that shit was already sussed in a motherfucker. But what set the bitch off? But was in this nigga said, You don't gotta have a big dick, but if you do, it'll show sure help though. Cause they like niggas that's packing. Oh, so we prostituting for the fucking modeling agencies, huh? Nigga said, Make sure when you send the picture, turn your dick in the drawers so it run down your leg. 
<gasps> bitch! And he was sending them bitches within seconds apart, nigga. Man, this shit made me want to go fucking hide. See, I'm 21. I got a legal gun. It's legal. I can keep that bitch carried with me. Man, I was in my fucking room, locked and loaded, waiting to blow the next bitch that came through my door down. Shit, I would have felt bad for my grandma. Look, grandma, you come through the fucking door, get your ass shot. Because, man, I'm scared now. The motherfucker said, you ain't got to have a big dick, but it helped. Fucking get it. Why me, man? Why fucking me? These motherfuckers in my mess just talking about you got a tight little old ass. <laughs> bitch. <laughs> bitch, nigga, fuck ho. I'm finna blank in this bitch. I don't fucking understand. Why in the fuck are you so fucking aggressive? Bitch, you know I ain't fucking gay. I got a whole girl. I don't say shit similar to some gay shit. Oh, at all, nigga. And even if you did think I was like that, that's how you approach it, nigga? You got a tight old ass. Who you sex as hell. You like dick? Send me a picture of you in your drawers with your dick running down your leg. What the fuck? Oh, shit. That shit gotta fucking stop. So, yeah, man, that's, that's my story about some gay dude try to holler at me. Yeah, I never fucking forget it. Nope. Bitch, I ain't out here on the low. I ain't on the low for shit. Bitch, a loaf of bread for me cost fucking four dollars. So fuck shit. Mm-mm. Hell no. Nah. But look, man, that go the video, bruh. I hope y'all like this shit. Hope you fucking laughed. Make sure you like, subscribe. Leave your boy a comment. Hashtag P Squad. Hashtag Savage. Huh. We growing fast and we're gonna take over the internet. Breaking shit, huh? The two new videos gonna be on the screen when the bitch go black. So with that being said, I'm out. Peace. <laughs> Shonen Yoshi